Hey everyone, welcome to our most festive updates of the year. But before we get into our announcements, a quick reminder that you can sign up for our weekly newsletter, which is stuffed like a stocking with even more information and events on our website, rockpoint.ca. And if you've got any questions about what's going on this season, please reach out using our digital connect card found either at rockpoint.ca slash contact or by scanning this QR code. And with that said, let's pour some syrup on our spaghetti and dive right in. Our outreach production, Christmas in Pleasant Valley, is coming up this week on Friday, December 15th, Saturday, December 16th, and Sunday, December 17th. Our cast, crew, and creative team have been hard at work putting together this new musical comedy about a gold rush town that can't seem to get along at Christmas. We're asking all Rock Pointers to invite some friends and family and make new Christmas memories together with us next weekend. And because this outreach event is so important to us, We've cancelled all regular services on the 16th and 17th and invited Bow Ridge and West Hills to join us at Bear's Paw for the show. I hope to see all of you there. The following week, Rock Point will be celebrating Christmas Eve. Our services at Bow Ridge will be at 6.30 p.m. on the 23rd and 9.30 a.m. on the 24th. At West Hills, we will gather at 10.30 a.m. on the 24th. And at Bear's Paw, we will be celebrating at 10 a.m. and 3 p.m. on the 24th. In addition, Bear's Paw and Bow Ridge will have liturgical services at 11 p.m. on the 24th. Now, we've had some concern that there may only be candles at our liturgical services, but don't worry. All of our Christmas Eve services will incorporate our tradition of candlelit carol singing. One final reminder that our Surviving the Holidays Grief Share Seminar is happening on Sunday, December 10th at 6.30 p.m. at our Bow Ridge site. If you are grieving the loss of a loved one this holiday season, know we are here to help you walk through the challenges you are facing. To register, head to the Rock Point events page. Rock Point Intercultural would like to invite everyone to grab your favorite dish and join the RPI program participants and volunteers for our Christmas celebration and potluck on December 18th from 6 p.m. to 8 p.m. at our Northeast location. The event will provide an opportunity for fellowship and food as we come together to celebrate the birth of Christ. If you have any questions, please feel free to email intercultural at rockpoint.ca. Our final update comes from the property stewardship team. In late 2022, the Rock Point membership voted to sell the Bears Paw land east of the fire hall for $1.4 million. This fall, after the Bears Paw roof was completed, we received five offers on the land within one week. Certainly God's timing was involved. The elders board and PST entered a time of discernment, listening to God, and we clearly heard from the Holy Spirit and made a unanimous decision. We are pleased to announce that the Bears Paw land has been sold to a developer who plans to build a daycare and after-school program facility on the land. We look forward to joint opportunities with the new owner. The funds from the land sale were received last week. As per our policies, proceeds from any capital assets become part of the development fund and must be used for future capital needs or to pay down debt. This week, we paid off the short-term loan for the roof, paid down almost half a million dollars on our long-term debt, and retained some funds in the development fund for continued development work on West Hills in 2024. Praise Jesus. In the past month, we have also started up a West Hills discernment team led by Ken Siemens to evaluate needs and preferences in the Southwest for a permanent home for the West Hills congregation. The first step is to look at the future needs of the communities south of the Bow River and west of Crowchild Trail and the internal needs of the current church. These needs and preferences will be compiled into a Southwest vision for Rock Point by April when we will start to evaluate options for a long-term home for West Hills. We will share progress with you all and have a plan together hopefully in time for the AGM in October 2024. The key is for all of us to discern and listen to God's direction for West Hills. We thank you for your prayers in the past year for the Bears Paw land sale and ask all sites to continue praying for West Hills' future and where the Holy Spirit will lead us. Lynn Cousins will be leading the prayer team on this. If you would like more information on either topic, please contact Ross Hollock at rhollock at rockpoint.ca. We are thankful for the blessings that God has bestowed on our church. That's all for me for today. Happy Advent, Rock Point.